If you think your PC is a safe haven, think again. Today, we're talking about six free programs that you should never put on your PC. Stay with me because I'll tell you why. Hit subscribe and get ready for some tips on keeping your computer safe. Let's make sure your PC stays in good shape. Let's start with Adobe Acrobat Reader. It's a popular way to look at PDFs. It's got the basic features, but it's kind of slow and sneaky, like adding extra software you might not want during setup. A better choice? Try Foxit PDF Reader. It's quicker, less annoying, and lets you do more things like filling out forms and writing on PDFs. Now onto Adblock Plus. Many people use it in Chrome and Firefox to stop ads, but even though it's supposed to block ads, it actually lets some through if the company pays. Not everyone knows this. If you want an ad blocker that's really clear about what it does, uBlock Origin is a good pick. It works with lots of browsers and doesn't let companies pay to show you ads. LastPass is up next. It's a famous password manager you can use for free or pay for more features. It works on many devices, which is great. But wait, there's been some trouble like a big security problem in August 2022 where they lost user data, and then another hack later. This makes us ask, is it really safe? If you want to keep your passwords super safe, think about trying Bitwarden or KeePass. They have a better record of keeping things secure. For those using Windows, if you're still on Windows 7 or 8.1, you really need to update. These old versions don't get security updates anymore, which means they're not safe. Think about moving to Windows 10 or 11. Or if you want something totally different, try Linux. There are lots of free versions that are fresh and new. Next, antivirus extensions. Be careful with browser extensions from antivirus companies. They're usually not that great and can get too nosy with your personal info. Most modern browsers already have good security features, so you might not need these extensions at all. Last but not least, let's talk about Hola VPN. It's a service lots of people use to get around website blocks. It's famous, but it's got some issues. There are worries about it tracking users and even using their computers for other things without telling them. For a better choice, try ProtonVPN's free version. They don't track what you do, and you can use as much data as you like. And that's it for our list of free programs that should never be on any PC. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, please give us a thumbs up and share your own ideas or better alternatives in the comments. If you're new to our channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for more tech tips and software advice. Thanks for watching.